are new here, my name is Lena. I make videos about fashion, photography, lifestyle, all that fun stuff. Right now I know my channel looks very much fashion only, but I am trying to have other types of videos as well. And if you're interested, you can follow me on Instagram. And if you've been watching for a while and want to subscribe, you should totally hit that subscribe button. There's a like button. Surely hit that subscribe button, hit that like button if you like this video, and yeah, let's get into it. As you can tell from the title of the video, I am thrifting today. And by today, I mean two weeks ago when I shot the clips and then the try on stuff that I'm shooting right now. Hello everybody. We are in the car because we just arrived to Goodwill. This is my first time thrifting since the pandemic started. I have a couple of things on my list, so we'll see how successful I am, but got my handy dandy mask, got my phone, and I got some sanitizer. I'll put this uh, in my bag because usually we have it in the car, but I'll put it in my bag and bring it with me. But I'm excited to see what I find. Hopefully there's some good stuff. But yeah, let's go inside Goodwill now. Alright, party people, or I guess not going to parties right now because of COVID people. Uh, I went to my second thrift store today and I, well today as in, I went to a second one today. Not like I went to two today, you know, I went to like first one yesterday and then now I'm going to the second one. Or I did just go to the second one. But you know what I mean. And I did some damage. I am very excited to show you guys everything I got. I feel like this haul ended up being a lot of like jackets and layering pieces, which I feel like I'm like in the fall mood. So, oh yeah, I don't need this anymore. Uh, I've been like looking towards fall fashion a lot lately, so that's where my mind's at. So like a lot of the things I got are for fall fashion. So it's been about two weeks since the clips you guys just watched. Uh, we had a crazy heat wave in LA and so it was too hot to do any of this and to do any of the try on and I was like sweating bullets every single day so I decided to wait till now to film it because it's finally like a decent temperature outside. But I'm really excited to show you guys what I got from the thrift stores. And I know I didn't really film a lot in the store. It's kind of hard for me to film in the store. Maybe I'll get better at it, but I'm just like so like focused, you know, on finding pieces. So having said all that, let's just get into the items. So the first item is this shirt I'm wearing right now. It is an Obey t-shirt. I don't know, it just felt, it spoke to me and I really wanted it. And it kind of like matches my hair right now and it like looks really good. I am a huge fan and I love that the O, the nail is chipped on it. So I thought this was like a really cool graphic. This one was pretty cheap. So I was like, hell yeah, I'll get this t-shirt. Plus you guys know I love graphic tees. So like, I'm not gonna say no to a graphic tee, even though I probably should because I have too many, but we are working on that. So this is the first item that I got. Okay, also, sorry if these clothes are wrinkly. Um, I had them in a laundry basket and I did not steam many of it. Oh, come on, man. So if it's wrinkly, that is why. Next, I found this top, which is kind of like a risk. <laughs> I feel so dramatic. I'm like, this is a risk for me because it's not something I normally would wear or I would even look for, but I did buy some cowboy boots recently and it made me think of that and so I got this top. Um, I think the print is so pretty. Like look how pretty this is and I love this like tassel detail on it and I like that it's like a vest kind of. So I thought this would be like a fun piece for like the summertime while it's still hot. I love this like square pattern, square diamond pattern on it. Next up, we have this button up, which I'm really excited about. I get a lot of my button ups from the men's section because I like the oversized look. And I don't know, 
I don't know if anyone else feels this way, but sometimes I feel like when you're at a thrift store, there aren't really a lot of things that like actually fit you perfectly. It's either like too tight or oversized. And it's kind of easier to go with like the oversized items when you're thrifting. So I have got this button up t-shirt thing. It has like a really pretty, it's gingham. I don't really know what this, this like pattern is, but it's from Tom Brown. Right, that's how you say it, Tom Brown, New York. I thought this would be really cute to like layer up, to like tie, to tuck in. In the fall, I could put like a turtleneck underneath it and it would look really cute. And I love this like picnic print, whatever this print is called. And so I bought two like flannel shirts. The first one is this one right here. This one is really pretty. And I love that, like, I don't know if you guys can see, it's like a very subtle, subtle, subtle uh, gradient. Who are these dogs outside? It's a very subtle gradient in terms of color. And I think it's really cute. I love how it fits. It's just so warm and snuggly and it's gonna be great for this fall. So I'm really happy with this find. It's from the brand Shades of Grey by Micah Cohen. It's great, I love it. And then for the other flannel shirt we have, okay, Hydrogen, you can't drink my water. We have this guy, this is from Field of Stream. It's super duper oversized. This is exactly what I wanted when I was looking for a flannel. This cotton flannel, so comfortable, so warm. This is gonna be amazing for the fall and I can't wait to wear it and style it. Of course, I'm gonna be home. We're all gonna be home in the fall, so. This will be for running errands or sitting at home and wanting to look cute or for the internet and YouTube videos. That's why we do these things. Because we have to give ourselves happiness somehow. And then, okay, so I found this shirt like when I was at the checkout. I saw it and it like spoke to me. Look how beautiful this color is. Like, Oh my God. And it's from Berlioni. It's from Italy. Oh, look at this color. Just look how beautiful this is. And I thought this would be like a great piece to like layer, to just wear, to tie. Like, oh my God, the possibility are endless. But like, look how beautiful this green is. I can't wait. Like, look how fun that is with my red hair. Just, oh, beautiful. I cannot wait to style this, to wear it. And I'm really happy with this find. All right, so next up we have bottoms, which, okay. These were a, you know, I wanted these to work. They're from the men's, they don't fit me. So these will be going up on my Depop. They're really pretty. They're from Theory. They're such cute little shorts with like, you know, nice pockets. Oh my God, these are so wrinkly. Um, but yeah, they're from Theory and they're so cute. They have like a little grid pattern on them. So the next bottom is the skirt, which oh, I'm so glad I found the skirt. It's so beautiful. And it is from Ralph Lauren or Ralph Lauren. Look how beautiful this is. Look how beautiful this is. It's a pencil skirt. It's made out of wool, I believe. Let's see. Tag say, yes, 100% pure new wool. And it's gorgeous. Which the length is not that flattering on my body per se, so I might want to hem it. I don't know yet. I'm going to wait until I'm a lot better at sewing and hemming before I attempt to touch this fabric. But it's so beautiful. And even if I just leave it long, I think it's gonna be really cute in the fall and the winter with like a black turtleneck, with some little loafers or oxfords. It's just, it reminds me of like uh, Audrey Hepburn in Pretty in Pink, like something like her bookish self would wear. But it's so beautiful and I'm really happy with this find. So let's get into jackets, my favorite section. And there's a lot of jackets. So, We'll breeze through them, hopefully. Jackets are my favorite section. All of these are from the men's area. Actually, one of them is from the women's, but let's go through them because I'm very excited for these pieces. So first up, we have this kind of like denim 
jacket is that how you pronounce it or it's like a shirt jacket and i got this from the men's section i thought it was really cute it feels very like stranger things 80s to me and i love that vibe i love that era of clothing and so this is definitely going to be worn a lot and i'm really excited for it it's just like a good layering piece you know jackets are great for layering the next jacket blazer well okay so i have a few blazers actually no let's go with this next so this next piece i saw it like right before i left council thrift and i was like oh my god i need to have it i think they like just brought it onto the floor and i scooped it up before anybody else could so this is a piece that i'm gonna wear and i told abdullah he could wear too because i think he really he really likes it Aww. and look at this it's a puma jacket it looks like it's from the 90s it's so cute and i love how oversized it is but look how cute this is Ugh. okay so now let's get into blazers first is this corduroy one which i really like i think it's so freaking cute it's from the men's section it's very oversized i love this like tan corduroy color i think it's really different from what I normally wear and so I thought this would be a great piece to kind of like have fun with it. I love these like little button detail on the sides. This jacket, I was like oh it's a really nice jacket. Turns out it's from JCPenney which no shade to JCPenney honestly. Honestly JCPenney has had some of the best clothing that I've had and so I really like this. I'm excited to wear this. It'll be a great piece in the fall and a great piece to style. The other blazer I got, I'm also really excited for. It has more of like a texture pattern to it and it has like this really pretty color. I like it a lot. I think this would be really cute with some denim, with some a plain tee, like a crop tee. This would be beautiful and I can't wait to wear this as well. I feel like I was saying that with all the items but like Honestly, what else is there to say? It's all cute. I love it all. I'm excited about all of it. Okay, the last blazer I got, I am very excited about it. I've been on the hunt for a blazer like this for a while now. So it's very 90s, it's very early 2000s. And yes, I got a leather blazer. So I think this one might actually be leather. Oh no, this is real leather. Wow. Wow. Uh, genuine leather, polyester lining, and nylon lining. Wow, this is a real leather blazer. I'm actually really excited that it's really leather because I did not pay that much for it. But, like, look how cute the buttons are, like, at the collar detail. This would be really cute for, like, 90s, early 2000s style to, like, just throw on top of a dress or a skirt type of outfit. And I'm obsessed, and I love this, like, purple lining. It's so beautiful. And I cannot wait to also wear this out as a jacket this fall. Okay, so this last piece reminds me of my dad because I swear my dad has something very, very similar to this. And I think it's amazing. And when I saw it, I just had to grab it. It is a super oversized leather jacket. It's from St. Hellier's. I found this in like the designer section of the store. So... It was a little pricier, it was $25. I don't even know if I can show you guys because it's so big and it's so freaking heavy, but I love it. It reminds me of my dad. It reminds me of like something Indiana Jones would wear. It's, uh, it's everything. I love it. I'm obsessed. It's probably something I'm gonna keep forever. I love that it's brown leather. It's just, it's perfect. It's just the perfect jacket. And I know everything I got was like oversized, but that was kind of where my head was at when I purchased everything. Plus, like I said, like it's a lot easier to find oversized items at the thrift store than it is to find stuff that like actually fits me. So I'm really excited about all these items. I'm sad that the shorts didn't work, but it's okay. You know, that's the risk you take when you go thrifting during a pandemic and you cannot actually try stuff on in store. I hope you guys like this video. Let me know in the comments down below if you want me to do more like thrift haul videos, if you like this kind of video, if you like my new background, you know, leave a comment below and even let me know which item was your favorite from the stuff I found. I personally 
trying to think of what my favorite item is. And to be honest, I think it's that last jacket I showed you guys. It's just like oh, everything to me. Yeah, thank you guys for watching this video. I hope you enjoy and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.